I'll tell you what my problem is with Keurig coffee is that it's nasty. It's not even coffee. First of all, you know as good and well, Mr. Keurig, that it's hot brown water. Dude, I'll drink nine Keurigs and take a nap, dude. You know what I'm saying? I'll give Keurig to a baby because it ain't gonna do nothing. You want some real coffee, go find somebody granddaddy when they had that cup of that strong sipper. When he woke up and took that hitter, that drip droppity drop, you had to swallow twice to get a dram of it down your throat. That was coffee. That thick, syrupy, yang yang, boy. I mean, that shit would straighten your granddaddy's spine. Scoliosis, no leosis. Two pots of grandma's coffee is what got the railroads built. And Curie got here selling this cuppity cup. Oh, the pods, and you pop them and ew, ooh, French roll. Eat a dick a dick a dick. Keurig, you know you're making bullshit. And that's what's wrong with a lot of men in this country. Y'all drinking that Keurig pod. Get out there. Get that little baby sheet. Throw the grounds on it. Put it in the thing. Turn it, shut it. Bam, water time. Get that hitter. Put it in a cup. And get your life done. Keurig is what's turning all these men into ballerinas. These men out there. Can't even walk. Ain't even wearing boots anymore. They're out there tippy-toeing. Shopping for carpet. Drink regular coffee and be a man. That's what I'm saying, dude. So I don't mean to get violent there or get fired up. But Keurig should be held accountable. This should be a class action suit against Keurig for turning all these men into straight whites. Because that ain't coffee you're selling. This jumpity water. That's all that is. Dude, I had two cups of Keurig, woke up wearing a thong. What's going on? Something isn't right. Drink regular coffee. Get the grounds. Get that little upside down baby hat. Put the grounds in the hat. Put it in the thing. Water, water. Top, close, button. Wait. Hot pot. Put it in a cup. Get that hitter. This past weekend, 